مدارس عنيزة الأهلية رؤية جديدة إدارة واعدة خبرات تربوية رائدة خدمات تعليمية متميزة السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أهلا بكم جريد 9 مع درس جديد من دروس الإنجليش معاكم مصفاة مسعيد مدارس عنيزة الأهلية المصار المصري Today إن شاء الله we're gonna study and revise the ability and inability in the past If we want to introduce the ability in present at first, in present we use can or can't. In ability can and inability can't. For example, I can cook, she can ride a horse. Can we run for one hour? This is as for present. What about the past? In the past we use could and couldn't. For example, I could cook very well. She could ride a horse. Could you run for an hour when you were younger? So here, can and could for ability. Can't and couldn't for inability. Great. Another type to express ability when we use am or is or are able to. So here, am or is or are able to equal can in present. For example, she's able to write well. Take care of something, my dear. Don't forget verb to be. Don't say she able to without uh, adding or putting is. She's able to write well. He isn't able to drive. Don't forget also she isn't. Don't say she not able. It's not right to say she not able. She isn't able to drive. Is he able to speak French? So this is as for the present. What about the past with able to? Also, we add verb to be, but in past, was or were, able to. For example, age three, she was able to read when she was three years old. Age two, he wasn't able to walk. Were you able to get a job? So here, in present, am, is, are, able to, in the past, was or were, able to. So it expresses also the ability and inability. Go to another type of expressing ability is manage it to. Manage it to. In present, manage it to. She always manages. Take care of s. Manages. Because of she. It's singular. To finish her homework on time. I don't usually manage to get on time. Does he manage to sell all his products? So this is as for present with manage to. What about past? Manage it with ed at the end of the verb. He managed to book a hotel. She didn't manage without d because of didn't. She didn't manage to pass the test. Did he manage to finish the project? So the question. Start the question here with did. With did. But what about able to that we studied, we studied before in the last uh, slide? We started the question was was or where in the past. But here with manage it to, we start the question with did. Okay. Some notes here. We use could to express ability in the past without a certain situation. Take care of could. Could without any specific or certain situation. We speak generally about something. So we use could. But we use couldn't in the negative to express inability in the past, either in a general or specific or certain situation. Take care of this point. So, could in general situation. What about couldn't in either general or specific situation? So, what about was or wasn't able to? Or were or weren't able to? They are used to express a certain or a specific situation in the past. Of course, in the past, specific or certain situation. Can we use them in general? Of course, also. We can use them in general situation. But just to cut in general, we can't use it with certain or specific situation. Okay, so it's a great. Now, now let's go to some exercises with can, can't, could, or couldn't. Let's start the play. Question one. We will use the, uh, your options are can, can't, could, or couldn't. You have four options and 15 questions. Let's start. Jack dash swim when he was born. The kid was born, so in the past. 
when he was born. He can or can't. No, I can't use can or can't because of the past. So when he was born, he couldn't, of course, or could. Couldn't. Great. Great job. So it's couldn't. Jack couldn't swim when he was born. So this is a repetition for the previous question. It's a repetition from the first clause. Jack couldn't swim when he was born. Okay. But he swim really fast now. The care of now in the present. And he really fast. So he can or can't. Could or couldn't. Great. Great job. My aunt jump high. She was the best. She was, the kid of was in the past. So it will be, who can see the correct answer? Great. Great job. Could jump. My aunt could jump high. I want you to observe that this is a repetition for the last question. My aunt could jump high. She was the best. But now she do it because she is 90. She's 90. She's very old. So she can't or couldn't. Great job. Can't. Can't do because of the present. Another question. He dash drive a car when he was a child. When he was, it's a past. And also he couldn't. So can't or couldn't. Well done. Well done, my dear. Couldn't drive. Another one. He couldn't drive a car when he was a child, but he drives trucks now. He is a truck driver. So, now he can or he can't. If we mention but, it will be the opposite of couldn't. So, the opposite of couldn't, can't. Okay, in, in the present. But now he can because he is a truck driver. So, the correct answer... Correct answer will be can. Cats climb trees. This is a, a fact, of course. Cats. My dear, excellent. Can. Cats can climb trees, but elephants do it. So it will be can, can't, could or couldn't. Cats climb trees, but elephants. Great job. Yeah. Can't do it. Another one. In eighteen twenty, people dash travel to America by plane. So eighteen twenty, it will be past or present. Of course, it's past. So it will be. Great job. Couldn't. In eighteen twenty, people couldn't travel to America by plane. But they go there by boat. Also in the past, take care. So it will be cut. Great job, my dear. Babies dash sleep all day along. So it's a fact. So I can't choose can, can't, could or couldn't. Excellent. Excellent. So it will be can. Babies can sleep all day long, but I, also it's a fact or routine, do it because I have to work. So I, who can guess the correct answer, it's very easy, can't. Great job. He called me for help because he do his homework alone. I want you, my dear, question 13 and... 14 and 15, I want all of you to answer it by yourself and send the answers to me. Send me the answers. Okay, my dear, great job. We have finished the end of our today's presentation. I hope you get benefit from it. Have a good day. Goodbye.